sharp bend coming. Hold on. Let's go do this side gig. I'm sure it will fix. Oh, oh wow. Oh, interesting. Okay. What is this brain dance? Oh, this is the edge runner. Yep. And if it's done, huh? What in the fuck? Over the edge. Alright. Hey, move found and strained X XPD on the street. Max Tax taking down some cyber hacker under the big hollow gold feast. Then at the end, the scroll named David. All right. Hey. Okay.
Exactly. All right. Nice. The beast in me, right? We're gonna do this one, right? So where uh, is there? Right. So let's go and fast travel. Was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. All right. So I feel like this is the best, right? The Oracle Optics. This is body attune, right? So let's buy that. All right, and then we will. Claire, you coming? I'm already here. Great. Be there in a flash. Promise. Right on. See you soon. Wait, hold up. Which trigger we using? Yours. Okay. Beast's ready to roar. Be right over. Later. If I wait till the buff goes away, probably, huh? I hope not. Hey, I bet a bundle on our win. Losing's just not an option, eh? Hey, look, Samson. Fresh meat. <laughs> Be embarrassing to lose to a rookie. Hey, V. Good to see you. So how's it look to you? NC badges are okay with this? NC badges can't see a problem around the stack of eddies put in front of them. Hey. They solve every problem, don't they? Eddies. Mm-hmm. You don't say. Any tips before we roll? Don't take your foot off the chew. My job will be to slow everyone else down. All Ultimately, right. it'll be speed, not firepower, that'll win us this race. Go fast. Got it. Oh, take the shard. We need to hit all the checkpoints or we'll be disqualified. If you want to hang a bit, do. I'll be in the rig. When do we start? The shard. It's all on there. Jinx it. All right. Attention, we got disturbance in Haywood. Kids causing trouble again. Okay, on our way. Go. Vehicle has been located. Details have been sent. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Sharp bed coming. Hold on. Heads up, car you back looking to ram. Good luck with that. <laughs> Go! Wow. 
Man. Last one. Heads up, car few backs looking Three to rain. And clear our victors. What did we just see? We fucking won. First place. Hey, you sound surprised. First fucking place. It's not that I'm surprised, it's just <laughs> I know, first place. I heard you. Let's hold up at the finish line a minute, just in case. You got it. All right. I can't see. Uh, yeah, I think this is an issue. Okay. I was getting confused because of that. All right, let's. Uh, I guess we'll go into technical because I want to unlock the body thing, right? So let's get that. Plus ten percent to all cyberware stat modifiers. Minus 20% cyberware capacity cost. So this will be really nice. Okay. Uh, max grenade charge. Faster use of health item. Reduce recharge speed for grenades. Okay. Borrow time. Okay. That's nice. Alright. So does that like... I guess does, that does increase... Let's tech the call. Do these races every year? My fourth time this. First time out I won. It gets you hooked. I can't give it up now. Can't or won't? What's the difference? <laughs> you do this for the eddies? The wins? The glory? Why do you race? It's like you've got laser focus. You don't like winning? Depends on the Depends prize. On what I stand to gain. And what I gotta put in. Yeah. Price can be pretty high. Did you say you lost your last driver? Can we not talk about it? Yeah, sure. Sure. Need a lift to the shop? Sure. Yeah, sure. All right, let's go. Are we done? We're not gonna do the second part? Okay, maybe it will come later, I guess. this NCPD. I can make some eddies.
See what it says. Okay. All right. Ooh. Yeah, this looks nice. Eh, there's something here also. Bounce back MK5, so that's nice. Alright, alright. So, so let's go and do some more NCPD stuff. This, this one. Alright. And I still can't. Ah. Uh, let's try the new. new Let's try the new shotgun. They're coming for me. Get some. Put some heart in. Boom. Hit him down. Still more people. What you two chicken? Ah. One mean motherfucker. Oh, had enough Reported crime, disloyal employee. I mean, that's fine. So we have to go up, right? Basically. Nice. 
let's do this gig and then we'll do this NCPD stuff here also. Right? And we will fast travel because I really can't save right now, which is annoying. I think there is some issue. There is this side piece here, just here. So let's go and check that out. What's up, huh? Hey, you! Sitting in the wrong spot. Uh, this... this is in the bar? Get up. Let's take a walk. Hey, leave him alone, cabrones. Hey, back off. And you're busy here. Leave him off. Pepe said. Take a fucking walk. <laughs> June, fuck off. Or I implant my blade in your ribs. Really think you're fast enough for that blade? Really? The way I see it. Be a smoking hole in your chest before your neurons even light up. But hey, nothing like a little experiment, right? Hey, right, come on, Pedro. Not worth it. Don't work out. Yo, fuck you! Carajo! Fucking punk! But what? What just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up now. God damn, sorry. I, I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. <laughs> Why? Why'd you help me? Because you look like you got some eds on you. I see. Nothing for free. Not in this goddamn city. Not in this goddamn life. Here, all I got. The rest, bartender got the rest. <laughs> Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in, Pete. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you then? On the house. Won't say no to a free drink. To good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. A break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just. Don't want to go home. What happened? Ten years married, you know. Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. <laughs> Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Pay solid. Yep. Run me through it. It's about my wife, right? Named Cynthia. She's cheating. I'm sure of it. Only question is, who will? Could let it eat away at me. Or I could get someone like you. Ain't no more than an evening's work. Sure she's cheating on you. Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Called her office one night. She wasn't even there. All right. Size that? Well, we got a kid together, right? Doesn't even look like me. Different hair, different eyes, all of it. Used to be easy to check these things. But with today's tech, there is a way around every test now. Gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'll be on a smoke break. Smokes like a goddamn tire fire. Look <laughs> at the city. Wait. Um, but today... She was wearing a pink jacket, and uh, mm, she had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? Why you want to know who she's with? What's the point? What's the point? What kind of gone question is that? <laughs> Simple one. Answer it. I want to look him in the eyes. Ask him how it feels fucking some other guy's wife. God breaking damn. up a happy marriage. Okay, fine. I'm in. You're my hero, V. Means a lot to me. Pepe Nazaro. CD Bar's betrayal of beguiling woman. 
Sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story. An unfaithful wife in a city where everything was uncertain. You about done. I'm trying to focus. <laughs> He's so cool, right? He's out of the sight. <laughs> 33 a.m., so probably not. I arrived on the scene looking for the woman in the pink jacket. The woman with a sordid past. Stop right there. It was her, the lady in pink, breaker of hearts, framed by a halo of cigarette smoke. I followed her. Dreaming of the day, the narrator put a fucking plug in it. <laughs> Got too close. Almost scared the dame off. Better be careful. I know, I know. The woman looked around. Something weighed on her. Maybe it was my gaze. <laughs> Keep this up. I'm a fucking puke. Narrate that. <laughs> the woman passes a bum, gives him a wide berth, doesn't want her clothes dirty. Her conscience is already dirty enough. <laughs> uh, seriously, wh what did I ever do to you? Got too close, again. Why you Something just drew me to her, like one magnet to it. The dame disappeared into the guts of a building ready to collapse. The air hung heavy with smog and betrayal. Ugh, maybe it's a good thing I'm dying. <laughs> hey, careful! You tear my shirt! Well, well, well. Let me see what's up, oh. Okay, nothing. you to make sure nobody followed you husband sent me suspected something what? see who's Wait. right no it's it's not like that I I can explain go on then let's hear it okay for for one thing he's not my input he's my ripper a specialist in plastic surgery what? A specialist in this dump look I know I I had this little accident a few years ago. The victim, uh, well, the patient's family still can't let it go. That's why I'm forced to work here. Hold on a sec. Uh, what about your kid? Here's the thing. I... Oh. I didn't used to look like this. I had a total body sculpt. Skin, hair, eyes, everything. Except, well, you can't fool your genes. That's why our son looks different than Pepe imagined. It's not because he's not the father, just that I... I don't look anything like the old me. But why? Why do that? And why do you think? Out of boredom? Because I was a rich, basic bitch? Everyone's got their own secret. Something they want to forget or leave behind them. I... I had a lot of them. And I can't share them with anyone. Not even my own husband. I know I should have told Pepe about all this, but there was never a good time. And, and now that I'm expecting again, it... Whoa! Oh, it, it, it wasn't... It wasn't planned. Please, uh, tell him... Tell him that... Yes? I don't know. I don't know what to tell him myself. That, that I'm really sorry. That life's an absurdist drama, okay? Just... Just go. Hit the nail on the head with that last point.
Job's done. Followed your wife. Went into some rundown pad. Man was waiting for her inside. I knew it. What else? Knew it, huh? Didn't know a thing. Didn't cheat on you. At least, not in the way you think. Huh? What way, then? She was at a ripper's getting a scan. Her skin, hair, eyes... It's all implanted. Every single last part of her. So... my son... That's why he... Exactly. Jesus fucking Cristo. How could you keep this from me? Our own husband, ten fucking years. It's not about the skin or whatever, it's that she lied. How the hell am I supposed to trust her now? Okay, yes, Cynthia was hiding something from you. Yes, she lied, but the woman loves you, you gonk. You know how much that means in this fucking town? If I were you, I'd just live and let live, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I guess you're right. Anyway, thanks. This is for you. For your troubles. Good man, Pepe. Take care. Silence fell like a wet blanket over the city, muffling its cries. Time to rest, I thought. Time to drink. See? That's more like it. Finally making some sense. <laughs>